Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys and today guys I'm going to go ahead and be showing you how to import songs from Apple Music to GarageBand. This is a very simple thing to do so make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end, follow my steps correctly so you can make sure that this works the same for you and you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. So the first thing you want to do is to go ahead and open up the official GarageBand application on your mobile phone if you're not already, if you do not have the application just go to the app store and download it and after opening it up you'll be greeted by this home page right here which is the main page where you can find all the instruments you can access you have your audio recorder and so on so let's go ahead and see how we can get started with importing songs from apple music to our garage band track so the first thing i'm going to do is open up audio recorder right here that's going to open up this recording menu and what we want to do is click right here in the upper left corner and the button in the middle this is going to open up this edit mode where we can find all the tracks that we have so you can see here are all my tracks that i have such as my drums, keyboard, audio recorder, and so on. And now let's say I want to import a song from Apple Music. Well, guys, basically, to be able to do that, what we're going to do is go right here in the top right corner, click on this button in the middle. That's going to open up this section where you have your Apple Loops and your files. So under Files is going to appear an option that says Browse Items from the Files app. So basically, guys, before you do this, you need to go ahead and download the song as an MP3 file. You cannot do that directly from Apple Music. What you can do is to go ahead and download it from the internet. You can go ahead and find the link to download your song that you have from apple music and after that guys then you'll be able to find the mp3 file right here in your files app or in your icloud go ahead and tap on it and after tapping on it and selecting it's going to appear right here so you can just drag on drag, drag and drop it right here into your tracks and get started with using it but yeah guys basically that is how to do it so i hope this video was helpful if it was make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel so you guys thanks for watching take care and bye